find the lcm of 80 and 96 to find the lcm for that we should frame it in this way 80 comma 96 this is your step one now you should focus on to the first number which is 80 here in this number last digit is 0 so take 5 first number 8 a number close to 8 in 5 table is 5 once 5 8 minus 5 3 3 carried forward 30 when do we get 30 in 5 table 5 6 30 the other number 96 last digit is neither 0 nor 5 so this is not divisible by 5 so you write it down as it is now here we have 16 16 is 2 8 16 the other number 96 last digit 6 a1 so this is divisible by 2 first number 9 a number close to 9 in 2 table is 2 4 8 9 minus 8 1 1 carried forward 16 when do we get 16 in 2 table 2 8 16 now here we have 8 8 is 2 4 8 the other number 48 last digit 8 e1 so this is divisible by 2 First number 4, when do we get 4 in 2 table? 2, 2 is 4. The other number 8, when do we get 8 in 2 table? 2, 4 is 8. Now here we have 4, 4 is 2, 2 is 4. The other number 24, last digit 4, e one so this is divisible by 2. First number 2, when do we get 2 in 2 table? 2, 1 is 2. The other number 4, when do we get 4 in 2 table? 2, 2 is 4. Now here we have 2, 2 is a prime number, so 2, 1 is 2. The other number 12, when do we get 12 in 2 table? 2, 6, 12. Now we got 1 here. So focus on to the next number 6. 6 is 2, 3, 6. Now we have 3, 3 is a prime number. So 3, 1 is 3. So we got 1 in both the places. So our LCM is, LCM is the product of these numbers that is 5 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 finally into 3 when we multiply these numbers we get 480 is our LCM